in this tutorial i will tell you how to create a cross tab query we have our tables here the first thing you do is click the create tab and from here you select query query design then we will select our table now before i show you what this table is let's see i can double click here and now this is our table this is the data inside the table we have student id we have subjects and then we have the marks for quiz 1 quiz 2 midterm and final but we don't have the total here so in our cross tab query we are going to calculate the total let's see how we will do that okay let us start okay we click the create tab click query design from here we select our table okay now you need to click this button here the cross tab query button so once you click you will see some of the things here will change now remember in cross tab query we have something like this when we are creating the cross tab query we need to tell microsoft access that what we want to have on the rows one what we want to have in columns and how we want these values to be calculated so there are three basic things here to remember these are called the row headings that you are going to put these are the column headings that you need to put here and these are the values that will be calculated so let us see here now we have our table here so the first thing that we want on the row headings are the student id so i will click this from here you will select cross tab row heading so on each row we want to have the student id second we want to have the subject so the subject should be on the column now the part comes where we will be calculating it now we don't have any column here that has the name as total so this is total it's a variable that will be placed where the column and row intersects so let's call this one total this is the syntax how you are going to do it now we want the sum of all the assessment that is sum of quiz 1 quiz 2 midterm and final should be placed under the subject in front of the student id so here we write sum you have parenthesis open then you have square brackets now here we are going to write the field name then the operator that is plus and then you close the now you can see here we have the name of the variable that will be used to hold this calculated values the formula that we are using here it's sum for all these values okay here we have the formula for adding all these values now here we are going to use as before this from here we will select expression this is the expression that we have created here now here we are going to use value it means this value will be placed in each cell where 
the student id and the subject interact intersects so this is our cross tab theory now let's run this and see what happens now you can see here we have a student id and the subjects here now this all is the total for biology then you have chemistry maths and physics that is quiz 1 quiz 2 midterm and final the whole total is 87 and similarly for all these also so this is how you create a cross tab theory